Hello there, everybody! So, Butter Knight, Jake, and I'm here, and welcome back to Soul Nomad in the World. He says in the last episode, we got ourselves one of the alternate endings. I grinded a ridiculously large amount. Everybody's still kind of a little low level, but this time I went ahead and chose some uh, decor items that'll actually help us greatly. Yeah, he's level 46, he's still pretty weak, but I did change it up a little bit. See, there are some, some of these little decor, I believe. I got her called Divine Task. And what they do is, if the enemy level is higher, I'll take 30% less damage. However, this number is much higher in upgraded versions where instead of 30%, it'll be 38. Or down here in Kanan's group, it's, uh, you take 55% less damage. <laughs> Boy. Anyway. I changed it up a little bit. Also, like I said, I grinded a ridiculously large amount. And... No, wait, I don't want to go to decor, sorry. All the decor is all set up. And while I was grinding, I d was lucky enough to score myself one Super Gigafy. I also got these, a decrease at world enemy level, and reveal a hidden path. I'm not entirely sure what that does, but let's see what happens if I use it, though. Um, never mind, I can't use it. Fuck. Um... Well, let's try to do this. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward and get through the all the silly little cutscenes and all that good old happy junk. Why doing this? Okay. are still significantly stronger than I thought you'd be. Energy bliss. Okay. I'll go ahead and use the gig. I'll go ahead and use this just to be safe. If anything, I can just reload it if there's another battle afterwards, but let's do this. More power. All right. And the cool thing is, my Gig Edict will still affect because he's level 140 and I'm 134. So technically, my Divine Task will still take effect. So there is some good news there. Alright. Go ahead and summon as many squads as we can for this. You want me to kill? Yes. Precisely. My squads are significantly stronger than they used to be. Okay. And one more. Yes, even Galahad is stronger. Okay. Kanan is still one of my strongest, though. Wow, wait a minute, Galahad's much strong. Wow, Galahad's a higher level than... Huh. Alright. Okay. I can't use a tactic, so... <sighs> Let's save stamina and end my turn. Um... I use Miracle Jive. Should be able to hit him with demon force. Do it. Just to weaken him before I start attacking him. How much damage did I do? That's n not too bad. I also, just to be safe, I also equipped cups a couple of people with tyrant stairs. So if I go near him, he will be weakened by a little bit. Okay, move myself over here. And then use Adon. Okay. <laughs> Fuck my life! <sighs> okay, okay, okay. 
The divine task would... Okay, if I didn't have that divine task, I'm pretty sure Kanan would be dead. <sighs> you know, it's, it's interesting because this music is very fitting. Okay. Valiant for defense boost. Go ahead and use Blade Tango. All right. I'm coming, Raksha. Let's do this. more like it. Okay. I have a fighting chance against Raksha. Gaia Terra again. Why are you attacking Kanan? She's going to survive. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I use Enfeeble on him? I was hoping that would work, but I guess not. <sighs> this is like a legitimate war. Okay. Let's boost their defenses a little bit here. Valiant! bonus there. Corpus Grace. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Good job. She's going to be the biggest problem, though. I think because I'm lower level than her, the divine task won't work. No, I'm higher level than her, I think. So divine task won't work. Raksha's the one that's level 140, and I think... Oh my god. Well, Galahad and Thorndike are fucking dead. Good job surviving there. Oh my god, Kanan, you are so fucking sturdy, thank you! Show them what you're made of, Shauna. Raksha is our biggest problem, so we gotta get rid of him first. In an area full of freaking bosses, this boss is one we have to get rid of quick. Okay. Go! Smoking cookies here to try to relax a little bit. Hopefully this works. Okay, okay, okay. So far, so good. And the soldiers are starting to close in. Good job, Cuthbert! Although Galahad and, um... Yeah, they're, they're fucking dead. I don't think Death Letter will work, but I'm going to go ahead and use one of my vacations. Right. All of the enemies are moving in. Goodbye, Galahad. Oh, holy shit. You're sturdy, Galahad. Good job. Oh, fuck you, Dio. Okay, okay. Well, I mean... 
Yeah, fuck it, you can try. Hey! You did it! And now you're going to proceed to die. Or not. That would have been a good opportune moment to get a freaking level up, though. Oh, fuck. Hey! Good job! Okay. I still want to use... Gr I can't remember what Green Wisdom does, but... I'm gonna go ahead and restore life so he can use it, if need be. Yeah, fuck off, Raksha! We're studio stuff. I'm sorry, Minerva and Nora, but you're gonna die. And I will apologize for that. Okay. Let's see, who's up on the turn list? Shauna, me, and then Juno. Kanan won't get a turn until the two soldiers are done. So that's good. Alright. Keep laying on the hurt to Raksha. <laughs> the damage. And you're missing. Stop it. It'd be nice if I could use deep. <laughs> All right. Go. Show them your might. All right. Less than 2,000 health left. Go! Oh, that's what I'm talking about. More power. Freaking love this theme, though. Even though I'm kind of evil, I like the way this sounds. How they're just struggling in vain. Die, Raksha! <laughs> I did it. Now that all that's left is to deal with the small problem. You were a worthy sacrifice, Galahad. tried. Odie? Uh-oh. Fuck. That's the opposite of good. Okay. Decreased skill use number of all enemies. Yes! Sacre! <laughs> Worth it. Gaston? <laughs> Nobody dies like Gaston does. Glutton gain! <laughs> now finish them off. Or oh, finish him off. <laughs> oh, wow. You are one sturdy dude. That hurt more than I thought it would. You're not gonna live very long. Call it. Good job, guys. I'm 
I'm sorry. Okay. Goodbye, Minerva. Oh god. Endorf, you're severely lower level than I thought you would be. I shouldn't be using Devil Dance, but I'm gonna use it anyway. Even though these guys probably will survive. That or they will. Or not! Never mind! Okay. They are finally twi dwindling down. Bye, Gaston. <sighs> okay. You know, you're gonna die. I am sorry. Rock'em. I am sorry. Even though this music tells otherwise. Although now that I, if I think about it, this music is basically their theme. Their final struggle against, well, me. At least I think it might be the final struggle. Hell if I know. Okay, get rid of you. Go! Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. How much HP do you have? No, seriously, how much HP do you have that let you survive that bullshit? Where are you? 19. Are you fucking serious? And you just threw away your life. Goodbye. Fuck. Hey, Vitaly. Dio's gonna be the biggest, next biggest problem. Or not. Die. Good job. He did not last long at all. Okay. Show him your masterful blade. Boom! Toss away the shield like a motherfucking badass. Did good. I still find it interesting how um, Thorndike has a fire blade and Galahad has a blade of lightning. That's neat. Even though they are literally the same class, they have their own, you know, unique individuality. Which I think that is pretty good to me. Running out of demon blasts, but I'm gonna go ahead and save one of them for at least Lena. Okay. Definitely gonna use Glutton Gain again. And I'll save at least one glutton gain for somebody else. Boom.
Okay. Finish him off, guys. Please? Really? Seriously, soldier, you are fucking sturdy. Ow. Finally dwindling down. Oh, fuck you and me, you're medicinal. Die, Rufio. There we go. Okay, here comes Lena. Oh, never mind. I thought she was going to attack, but I guess not. Fine by me. I'll be the first one to attack then. She's by herself. Devil dance. Show them your power. By completely missing every single strike. Holy shit, every attack missed? Oh, that's right, her stats are unrealistically -re high. Let's do this. Let's hope this works. <laughs> you lose, Lena. Your last threat is now dead. Oh wait, technically Odie is quite a threat, so... And so is Endorf, now that I think about it. Yeah, just slowly dwindling down. Go, Kanan! Show them your power! Oh, fuck you and your Hadouken. Ow. That was a considerably powerful Hadouken. Okay. Shauna, can I trust you to get rid of uh, Grunsford for me? Good job, Shauna. <sighs> so now I know definitely need to stockpile on uh, divine tasks. Wilter! What's the matter? You frightened that I could actually heal all of my allies. I'm proud of you, Odie. Now die. Oh. Good job, Odie. I'm really proud of you now. Hey, Endorf. Hmm. Goodbye, Pinyo. Good job, guys. 
Oh, fuck my life, man. Ow. Ow. To be fair, you can do better than that. Ow. Mama, that hurt. That? Rude. It's fitting that I think Shauna should be the one to end Endorf. End Endorf. End Endorf! Jesus Christ! That was more than I was expecting. Goodbye, Odie. There's nothing I can't do. Yeah. What if this will actually hit him? Holy shit, it actually hit him! Goodbye, Odie. Farewell. Sorry, Juno. I really am. Do it. Goodbye. Demon Path really fucking punishes you. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love the challenge, but Jesus. This might have been one of the hardest maps I've had to go through. <sighs> Vitaly and Pino are the only ones that are left. I'm gonna be pissed if I ended up wasting my freaking um, uh, super gigafy, and then there's like a a super version of the next of this map next. Like all the war, uh, like all three world eaters all at once. Fane, Raksha, and um, Theris. Ugh, that would suck. You're just delaying the inevitable. Goodbye, Pino. You got some good evasion there, Pino. Holy and divine this music sounds, and then <laughs> just the fact that I'm evil. Although, in terms of feeling, it kind of reminds me of the final battle for uh, Lapuscell tactics. Okay, maybe not the final, final battle, but the supposed final battle. I'm trying to avoid this without spoilers for those who haven't even enjoyed Lapuscell yet. Goodbye, Vitaly. And they're all decimated. And that's that. Oh. Is 
Everyone dead? <laughs> yep. Not a single one left. I see. That takes care of all the annoying insects. Nobody left to bother us. You satisfied? Ah, oh, don't tell me you're all lonely now. Hey, I should be more than enough company, right? You and me together forever till the end of time. <laughs> Huh? What the hell? What? Hey, kid, what are you doing? Hey! Hey, what do you think you're doing? The hell's going on? No, no, you can't! You can't eat me! Not after all this! What? But why? How can you. Uh. Uh, uh, did, did, did I, did, did I just fucking eat gig? Uh, the power. <laughs> did I just fucking laugh? Everything before this was nothing. <laughs> So, I can't summon anyone anymore. <laughs> now I'm all alone. Uh... Um... Drizil, by consuming Gig, this soul has attained the power of an overseer. And the path to the other world is still open. At this rate, both worlds. Indeed, Hafnis. We must make contact. Uh oh. Devour Lord. Devour Lord? Hello. Who's there? I am Hafnis, god of this world. What do you desire? Nothing. And I am Drazil, god of the other world. The power you've gained rivals even our own. But with such power comes a certain obligation. You have to stop this senseless destruction. No. I don't want to. Don't you understand? Our two worlds might disappear completely. And you along with them. Fine by me. Happiness, I'm sorry. This is all my fault. I planted the seeds from which this disaster grew. So what? No, it's my fault. My words. They couldn't reach this lost soul. Yeah, sure. Then there's nothing we can do. We have only one path left to us. Very well. If that is our only choice, that which rules all. Asher, please grant us your divine grace. Power! Uh... We you must use this power to stop, stop the evil. evil. Just try it. Demon Blast! How? Even without gig. Demon Blast! Oh, the world! Demon Blast! Into nothingness! Demon Blast! It doesn't matter. It was fun. Uh. Um. Ah. Oh. Ah. 
Uh. Um. Uh. You fucking serious? Well, what happens now? Is it just going to go straight to the next save? Or was that it? Surely there's some sort of ep- There's no epilogue?! Really?! The continent of Prodesto. Okay then. The grueling war had fought. Well, I guess that's that. That was the demon ending. Huh. Oh. Why the fuck didn't I even look at the name? <laughs> Final battleground. Yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it makes sense that this would be significantly shorter than the, um, hero path. I mean, it makes sense. Huh. <sighs> Man, that was... You know what? I actually like that. It was actually pretty good. I can't... I, I, it sounds weird me saying this. I actually enjoyed the demon path. It was ridiculous, but I enjoyed it. It was a lot shorter. But, um, well, I finally got to play the game that I've been wanting to play for the longest time, and I'm satisfied. This is a legitimately fun game. I recommend this game for anybody that likes RPGs and strategy games. I would recommend this greatly. You guys should all, I think you guys should all play this. This is a very good game. Holy shit. I need to hold a voting poll. <laughs> For what's gonna take the place of this game? Actually, since I'm, I'm gonna handle it a little bit differently, um, probably after this uploads, I'm gonna try to get a video ready to follow after this, where you guys can, you know, the rules will be stated in the voting poll and all that good happy junk. <sighs> okay, final thoughts. I gotta admit, I thoroughly liked both sides of the story. I liked the hero path, and I liked the demon path. I can't really hate either one. I mean, on the hero path, freaking Raksha sort of had a redemption, was, you know, freaking good, and tried to, you know, fight back, which was, I thought was actually pretty damn cool. Like, it really improved my opinion of him. And, um... God, this, this... Uh... It, oh, it also felt weird getting to have characters that I wasn't able to have on the hero path, and have these characters that were, uh, fr that were enemies, as allies. It felt pretty freaking cool. It was pretty good. Also, just gonna say, Kanan's freaking attack is broken as shit. The one that lets her drop her opponent's HP down to one, that is badass, but that is fucking broken. But, um... Damn. I had to really do some hardcore grinding, and I'm actually glad. D okay. Did it be is it because that I... Was I? Is it because that I was on a new cycle that the difficulty was revved up and the enemies were significantly stronger, or was that just their base level for the demon path? Just out of curiosity, I'm kind of curious about that. But um, damn. I still think I prefer the hero path, mostly because from what I've been told, there are actually multiple endings, and the ending that I got was the Danette ending. From what I've been, from what I've heard, which I kind of liked it, and I mean, hell, Gig got to be getting his own form, which was pretty neat too. So, out of curiosity, I'm probably gonna look up, see what kind of like what the other endings are. I wonder if there's a Juno ending. That'd be pretty neat if there was. But um, 
I'm d I'm done. This I enjoyed this. Soul Nomad was every bit as good as I hoped it would be, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. <sighs> and I hope you guys enjoyed it too. So, thank you all very much for joining me on this little let's play. I enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Oh yeah, don't worry, there will be a voting poll video coming up very soon, so stay tuned for that.